Hey guys, good morning. JB here. So today I'm gonna show you how to program a 2001 Nissan Altima. And today we're gonna program the key. This one. You know, it looks pretty bad, but it still works. And as you can see that this key is not programmed, security is flashing. We're gonna try to open the key and as soon as you open the key the light stays on and it doesn't work. All right. and the reason we are reprogramming this is because the immobilizer went bad it doesn't work and it takes a lot of time to read the key and it's just not doing any any job right here so that thing is trash okay there's two ways you can program this key you can either use this tool the max assist but also you can use this one which is a t300 and this one is cheaper it's like probably a hundred bucks that's the cheapest tool you can buy if you want to do it your own and um I'm gonna do it first with the tool so I can show you how this works. The first thing, just open the key, switch on, and we're gonna go to nets. Uh, hopefully, it works. Okay, so once we are in, we're going to choose this one. Registration with ignition key because the other ones are for electronic and we're gonna choose this one we're gonna register a new key you see the light is off now from 2000s to 2004 I believe they use some they use a fixed pin code which is 5523 so um, this tool obviously has that built in already and it's just doing this by itself but in this tool you have to input the code manually and I'll show you in a bit how to do it how to do it with this one all right so once we have the tool right here we're gonna choose our Nissan it's a US model and the system that this car uses is the type 4 it's between type 4 or 5 um, if 5 doesn't work then you try 4 if the system 4 doesn't work then you try 5 and vice versa put the ignition on hit enter with to communicate and it's not fine we okay, enter we scan for faults if there's no faults okay so this is the code that I was working on the dongle wasn't working because this it was too slow there we go so we clear the codes now and clear there's no ones. So now we choose those special functions, programmer keys, and it's gonna ask you for the code. Remember, from 2001, 2000, I'm sorry, to 2004, they use the same code. And to know that, if you remove the steering wheel and you check your dongle, if it has the letter A, that means the code is 5523 five, but if, if it has another letter that's a different story you have to find the code or the code the BCM module so we put our code 255523 we hit enter yes it's correct programming keys and it should say programming successful 
there we go keep program and that's how you program the key it's easy and simple like this guys so either way you can use this tool or if you have like this one this is like for the multi-use cars but if you want to go the cheaper way this is the tool to go it has a lot of cars to program the tool. Then we go in W's, Chevy's, Dodge. I have a problem with Dodge with this one too. Ford's too. Honda's too. This tool is really, really, really useful. So, if you have any question, guys, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and see you next time.